Hi everybody, this video is an attempt to summarize the math requirements for different programs at Grace Harbor College. So I'm not going to go into the course descriptions much about what's covered in each course, but I just want to show you the different math requirements for different programs. So from the top, um, Math 60 Arithmetic leads to Math 70, another pre-college math class, or Math 100. Math 100 is the math requirement for many vocational technical programs such as auto, diesel, carpentry, welding. So math, math 60 also leads to Math 70 beginning algebra. Math 70 leads to either Math 101, which is a vocational technical math class, or BA 104, which is math for business. And then Math 101 will count for an Associate of Applied Science in Human Services, Criminal Justice, and, and others. BA 104 Math for Business counts as the math requirement for counting, business management, business technology, hospitality, ecotourism, medical assistant, and, and probably others that I haven't found. Um, math 70 leads to Math 97, which is um, mostly Algebra 1 type material, it's Essentials of Intermediate Algebra. Um, that then leads to all of these uh, classes. Math 107 is Math and Society, it's for Liberal Arts majors. So think Music, Art, Criminal Justice, English and many more. That This will count towards a Bachelor's degree in, in many of these majors and also at a, the Associate of Arts Direct Transfer Agreement. Okay, that's what that means. So, um, so the classes with the ampersand will count towards a bachelor's degree for for some majors. Uh, Math one forty six statistics uh, counts towards nursing, you know, associate of direct transfer or bachelor's in human services, uh, forestry, and also the associate of applied science in forestry. Now we come to Math 131, 132. These are, this is math for elementary education. If you're planning to teach math to kids in any capacity, these are definitely the best classes to take. Um, so elementary education, the base program, early childhood education. If you read the course descriptions, uh, Math 131, the major objective of this course is to prepare the prospective K-8 teacher to understand elementary school mathematical co concepts taught from kindergarten through eighth grade. Okay, and and it goes into the details. Um, so Math 131 and 132 not only help you master material from K through eighth, but also how do you explain that? How do you understand that deeply? How do you create a lesson plan to teach that material to somebody else. So it's not just about being able to do the math from K through 8th grade, it's being able to deeply understand and teach that material. So then we go down uh, this route here. Now um, if you're getting the Associate of Business Direct Transfer, you would need Math 111 and Math 148 and their prerequisite is Math 98 which is Intermediate Algebra, similar to Algebra 2, right? Um, if, if you're getting an Associate of Science or a Bachelor's of Science in Science, Technology, Engineering, Math, lots of different areas, you might need the Calculus Sequence. So Math 141 is Pre-Calculus 1, and then that leads to Pre-Calculus 2, Calculus 1, Calculus 2, Linear Algebra, all sorts of other uh, topics there. So that's an overview of the math pathways. Um, I'm sure I've left something out. If you have any questions, please contact me, but I hope I've given you some sort of insight into math requirements for different programs.